All right, everybody, it's Wednesday. That means it is time for Comic Corner. Comic Corner. <laughs> oh, Matt. All right. I'm excited because I know that this week uh, Rob's got a special Comic Corner in, in store for us. Matt, I'm so excited. This, this week's Comic Corner, we're kind of uh, sidelining the comic books that are coming out yes. regularly yes. for something very exciting. We're going to break some exclusive news. I love that exclusive I can finally news. talk about. Let's do it. And the greatest thing, okay, so I've been doing this 30 years. Yes. And we, first of all, we have great great comic book fans as you know i always go matt we talk too much about comic books and you go, you go rob they love it we get yes. great feedback which is great to hear and 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 because i'm a comic book guy yeah and i'll try and fit a comic book into everything yeah even the bible <laughs> and uh so here's the deal so 25 years ago uh my life changed and the comic book industry changed yep. you don't get to the walking dead without what we did my, uh, my partners and myself uh we had just had a phenomenal run at Marvel, mm -hmm. and we decided that we would take a chance on ourselves yep. and roll the dice, and we started this company called Image Comics. Yeah. Image Comics currently is the third largest publisher uh, in North America and the world, mm -hmm. and people told us we wouldn't last six months. So, you know, we have like a fraternity among us, our, our, uh, the guys who started Image yeah. Comics. So, uh, the 25th anniversary, the very first Image Comics, Image Comic was Youngblood. Yes. And right here, Youngblood, the first uh, year's worth of Youngblood. It's like I'm selling something right here. You can get these on Amazon. Uh, the uh, <laughs> Youngblood launched 25 years ago. Yeah. Now, uh, I think there's been about 80 or so Youngblood comics okay. over 25 years. Okay. I, I turn the lights on and off when there's a great creative team. Yes. And let me tell you something. Youngblood has had a murderer's row of fantastic authors. Uh, Robert Kirkman has written Youngblood. Okay. Uh, Kurt Busick of Marvels has written Youngblood. Alan Moore, who someday I'll do the imitation, yeah. Watchman. Alan Moore Watchman <laughs> called me up one day and said, uh, and I, what? And he mumbled again. And I, you want to do Youngblood? That's what I said. And, and he did. <laughs> he did an acclaimed run of Youngblood. Yes. Um, so you got Robert Kirkman, Alan Moore, Kurt Busick. Um, the guy who publishes Image Comics right now, and he's a critically acclaimed writer, uh, is Eric Stevenson. He did a run on the book. Uh, all sorts of great, talented guys. Mark Miller, Wanted, yep. Kingsman, yep. Kick-Ass, wrote Youngblood. So, Matt, I'm bringing back Youngblood. And yes. I'm sharing it here now with nerdy pop viewers. And awesome. here's the deal. Here's the deal. I have got to, the reason that I don't do Youngblood all the time is because the creative teams aren't always there. I have been presented with this great opportunity. Uh, I am currently doing Deadpool yep. with a fantastic writing team named Chad Bowers and Chris Sims. Okay. And they are fantastic. They write for Marvel X-Men 92, which is completely set in 1992. And it, it did so well as a miniseries, they gave it their own series. Okay. So these guys are just kicking ass. We're doing Deadpool together. And so I talked to these guys, and Chad in particular, and I have talked... Uh, slightly more than Chris. Chris, you know I love you. When you want to write Supreme or one of my comics, call me. But Chad uh, told me how much he loved Youngblood, and he grew up on Youngblood, and it did not make me feel old. It made me feel excited. <laughs> the excitedness, it was like comic book Viagra. I was like, I don't feel old right now. I'm so excited. And he came up and pitched me this Youngblood concept. So Chad Bowers of Deadpool and X-Men 92 is writing Youngblood. And check this out. I have the debut of the artwork for the oh, brand new cool. Youngblood. And I love that I showed Matt this before and Matt goes, that art is really good. <laughs> and it was followed by, did you draw it? And I said, no. <laughs> That's why it's so good. Um, so here's the deal. Here's the deal. Here's the deal. Jim Toe sent me this on Twitter. Okay. Social media is awesome. In the Early in the summer, he copied me at, at Rob Liefeld and said, hey, at Rob Liefeld, here's Youngblood. And I went, oh my gosh. And I immediately instant messaged him and said, I'm looking for an artist for Youngblood. And he's like, are you kidding me? That would be my dream assignment. Wow. And okay, when people say dream assignment, you hire them. Um, because <laughs> you're gonna get their best efforts. Yeah. And so here is, uh, we have Vogue, Sentinel, Shaft, Doc Rocket, Suprema. And then here's some close-ups he sent me. Yeah. And then I said, we, we gotta go a little, you can do whatever you want with these costumes because he's given new designs yeah. to Youngblood. Uh, 25th anniversary, this is gonna launch. Uh, in, in 2017 to commemorate the 25th year okay. of Youngblood and, and Image Comics. And then he sent me his traditional shaft. Uh, that's funny. My wife always makes fun of the name and I'm like, no, 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 it's, it's, not, it's not dirty. And, uh, <laughs> and, and, you know, uh, and, and, and so this is great. But dude, Chad talked to me about Bad Rock. Bad Rock is one of the fan favorites. He's like one yep. of the, wol the Wolverine of the group. Yeah, yeah. Very popular. And uh, if, if you look closely at this, 
this drawing of Badrock, he's breaking up into pieces. Okay. And there is a great story in that. We, re, we reintroduce Badrock in the story. The first issue is fantastic. So the best thing is Chad wrote the first issue. I gave it to Jim. Okay. They became fast friends and talk without me all the time. And then they call me up and go, hey, can we talk? Can we talk? Okay, pitch me, pitch me. Give me more ideas. And long story short, uh, Jim literally showed me pages before we went on the air. He sent me the first several pages because here's a great thing. Image Comics has a great new rule because books that ship late suck. Yeah. You have to have three in the can before they'll solicit it. Oh. So you have to bring 60 pages before they will let the public know that they have it. So we are banking pages. We're going to have issues out. We're going to launch in April. And I know the comic book world yep. is going to go crazy over this because Youngblood has had a crazy uh, uh, reaction every time we publish it. This launched right after X-Force, Deadpool, Cable, okay. hit a million a month. Um, you were still young and, and watching your <laughs> cartoons, but it was selling out. So anyway, Bad Rock, Shaft, Youngblood, they're all back. We're breaking this here. And awesome. so, so, so a new Youngblood with the writer of Deadpool, X-Men 92, and Jim Toe, who I think the world is going... If Matt Barnes immediately said, that artwork's really good, I'm in great shape. We're I love shape. it. So Comics Corner was completely self-serving, but <laughs> when, when in April, when it's selling out, yeah. we'll be here talking about Absolutely. that it all happened right here. Yeah. This, Matt, thank you. No, I'm excited. I, I mean, this is truly, this is really, a, I mean, what a great way to celebrate 25 years of, of just. With two kids who grew life. up on Youngblood yeah. going, hey, Grandpa Rob. Uh, not Uncle Rob. <laughs> Grandpa Rob. Grandpa Rob doesn't sound creepy. Right. Grandpa right, Rob right, sounds right, like your right. friend. Yeah. Um, <laughs> and Grandpa Rob gave the green light and Image Comics. You know, the great thing is I sent this to Robert Kirkman and I sent this to Eric Stevenson, two of my buddies and my bigger supporters. And they're like, Rob, this. This looks epic. This yeah. looks fantastic. So that's it. Youngblood. New Youngblood coming. 2017, 25th anniversary of Image Comics and Youngblood. And this team is going to rewrite the Youngblood history books. Well, awesome. I'm super excited for you. Thank I'm, you, I'm super excited to see it. Uh, you heard it here on Nerdy Pop first, of course. And uh, make sure you are uh, following us on social media at Nerdy Pop Show for all the latest information and, and breaking news and all the and things. And we'll have we these have. images up online. We will have these up online. We'll put them on the screen during this uh, segment as well. And then also, don't forget, we have a social media contest going on right now where you can win this uh, original art sketch of Cable that Rob did uh, for us. And uh, just go to nerdypopshow.com. You can pick that up. Follow us at Nerdy Pop Show. Uh, on Twitter and Instagram, and our, our individual social handles are on the screen right now. Have a great day. We will uh -huh. see you tomorrow. Woo!